Hello and welcome back to Tamara Claire and Co. So in today's video we are going to be designing a digital product together and this product is a printable set of affirmations. Um, these can obviously be done in different sizes, they can be slightly larger if you want to have them printed off as affirmation cards but this particular design we're going to do them as more printable strips so they take a lot less paper to print off. So without further ado let's crack on. So just a quick introduction if you're new to Canva, that's what I'll be using to create this design today. So once you've logged in, this is kind of the basic layout that you'll see. And so we are going to start by hitting create a design. And um, this particular one I'm going to do in letter size. So I will just type in letter and then US letter document. Okay, so again, if you're new to Canva, this is what you'll see when you open a new document. You've got the option here to title your design. So I will just call this Money Affirmations Printable Letter Size. So starting from the beginning, I'll just do my title page for this product. So I know the background color that I want my um, cover page to be, so I'll click here to select the colour. So they will have default colours here that you can choose from or if you're looking for a particular colour but you don't know the shade that you want you can type in here say purple for example and it will bring up different colour palettes that have that particular colour in. I know the colour that I want to use I will just type in here EFEBE2 and this is the shade that I want. Okay, so to actually create the title page, I'll start off with my text. So if you hit T, that will bring up a text box for you. The name of this product that I've been designing, it's part of my I Am Wealthy AF range. And I want it to be Laura. If you know the font that you want to use, it will store your most recently used ones along the left here. Um, you can scroll through and find different ones. Or if you know what you want to use, like I know I want this to be Laura, so I would just type that in here. So we also want this to be emboldened. And the font size, I think, was 68.1. So I will just drop this down onto the second line to make it fit better. About here. I'll hit T again to get a new text box. This one I don't want to be capitalised, so I'll take that off and I'll take the bold off as well. So I've got the tagline for this product already so I will just copy and paste that in here and I will have a different font on this. I want this one to be Lumios and I will just using this little dragger here make it fit. I will just resize it and then drag it up here to sit just underneath my title and then I will just put by me and then I will highlight all of this and centre. Okay so I'm pretty happy with that as my cover page. So we'll go down here to add page and next up we want to divide the pages up to actually give us the spots to put the affirmations in. Um, so I'll just be using lines to do that. So the shortcut here is L to enter in a line. You can rotate it using this here. Stretch out like so. So this button here, top left, gives you the options to change line colour to whatever it is that you want. The one next to it. You can change the type of lines, whether it's solid, broken or dotted. You can give it rounded points. If I zoom in here, you'll be able to see. You can give it rounded points on the end, so that's the square end. Or we can round it off. And you can also change the weight of the line, so you can make it thinner, make it thicker, depending on what it is that you want. So I will just put in a line to divide the page. I will actually remove 
this colour from here and just make it a solid white just because I think it will print better. So we've got a line down the centre of the page here to divide it in two. I will also just add in some lines to break the page up into sections. So I'll just drag it across to make sure it goes all the way over. And that one's all the way to the bottom. So I will just do that to go down the rest of the page. I've got my affirmations written out already so I will literally just be copy and pasting them into text boxes throughout the page. So again, press T to pop your text box in and then you can just edit the font, edit the font size, if you want it bold, if you want it in a different colour. So I will just do that and I will start popping the affirmations in now. Okay, so this particular product has over 50 affirmations in it, so obviously they won't all fit in on a single page using this layout. So I will just go ahead and fill in the rest over the next couple of pages. And there we have it, the final finished product is done and ready to go up on sale. I hope you have enjoyed the video, remember to subscribe for more videos all about making digital products for yourself or to sell. I hope you have a lovely rest of the day. I'll see you next time. Bye-bye.